when I'm leaving, when, when <laughs> Tegan's leaving, you know, telling me that line from Anna Paquin about, you know, making sure you, you, you enjoy it. That's, that's so real and important as well, because, you know, you can so often be caught up in these things and forget to let it sink in and, and enjoy those moments as well. Hello, Jessica. Hello, Tegan. Thank you so much Hello. for your time. A pleasure to talk to you both. So I'm going to start with you, Jessica. How does it feel uh, watching your real life like experience, your real life experience unfold on screen? It's so strange. It's incredible. It's absolutely incredible though. It's it's odd, but a really good odd. <laughs> because they've done such a lovely job of it, I think. It might be different if they hadn't. <laughs> yes, wouldn't it? Yeah. Yes. And how is it for you, Tegan? Like the preparation to play Jessica was challenging, oh, was a yeah, lot of it was, pressure. <laughs> that it was harrowing and you know, I mean it was nice. I didn't feel too much pressure. I think what was so good was that she was 16 and I was 17 and we'd had similar kind of experiences, kind of family and all that. So I felt, and and Jess was so great. Um, just, we, Jess, Sarah, the director and I, we all chatted about creating the character and and wanting to create a character from the ground up, not just a mimic of Jess. And I think that took so much pressure off. And I was able to just, you know, learn to sail, have fun sailing, and um, had fun on the shoot. Yeah, how much did you learn sailing to sail? Oh, it was crazy. I mean, I never sailed before in my life, and I never thought I would. And then um, my sailing coach, uh, Danielle Hutchinson, who's also my sailing double, she was just an angel sent to me. And she was, um, oh, she taught me everything I know, and I couldn't have done it without her. Yes, and Jessica, looking back now 16 years old would you do that again <laughs> <laughs> i would but i would have to have the same boat and the same team and the same people involved because that's what made it possible and that's mm. what you know oh, made completely. it made it safe yeah that little boat she's the that she's little the real pink hero. lady she is she's so tough and it's just i think that that comes through in the film but it was just her just topping out those storms. Yes, and it's amazing. And for you, uh, Tegan, work with Anna Pekin and Cliff Curtis. How is mm -hmm. it for you? How is that experience for oh, you? Oh, it was incredible. I mean, they were inspiring too. They're such experienced, um, very lovely people. I mean, Cliff Curtis and I really connected, mm -hmm. and I think that came across in the film as well. And, you know, Anna Paquin is just such an icon, and she started young too, so she's an inspiration for me in that respect so it was incredible and they were just they were lovely people yes and jessica you i know that you, i understand that you wrote the script with sarah how is it for you to revisit like those moments and is, is there anything that you would do, would do differently oh in terms of the voyage or the yeah, <laughs> yeah in yeah. terms of yeah. riding it or the ship no yeah. well yeah i mean you could obviously say don't hit ships um that was the stuff up but it's all part of it and it was part of actually giving me the, the strength to get through the storms at sea. So in hindsight, it was absolutely maybe necessary, mm, as necessary as colliding with a ship can possibly be. But, um, you know, mum, when, when I'm when I'm leaving, when, when <laughs> Tegan's leaving, you know, telling me that line from Anna Paquin about, you know, making sure you you, you enjoy it, that's, mm. that's so real and important as well because, you know, you can so often be caught up in these things and forget to let it sink in and, and enjoy those moments as well. Yes, but I think that that, that phrase it fits a lot of like a lot of situations in our life. Like it's, yeah, totally. it's really, really amazing. And for you, Tegan, for us to 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 uh, wrap it up, yeah. uh, what was like the most challenging scene for you? The most challenging scene, I think, was I think a lot of the isolation scenes were quite challenging just because so like a lot of the phone call scenes are challenging because um, the other actors had all flown away back home. They'd finished. So it was just me and like the reader and like sometimes it was just the crew members reading opposite. But luckily I, I, I was um, quite isolated from my family at the time because of COVID. And so I was able to pull a lot of emotion from my real life and um, kind of put that into the performance. That's amazing. I just want to thank you so much for your time for both of you. Tiga, a lot of success in your career. And Jessica, keep sailing because <laughs> I think you like to do, do what I cannot do it. <laughs> do it <Yeah>. for me. <laughs> Absolutely. Sail for all of us. Absolutely. Thank you. <laughs> thank you so much. Bye bye. Thank you. If you like this video, don't forget to comment, to like and subscribe to our channel right here. <laughs>